What's up, Gemini? It's your girl, Isabella Tarot Tarot, back at it again. going to hit you with your daily message. Thank you so much for all the likes, shares, subscribes, love donations. You guys are greatly appreciated. I'm not currently accepting personals, but you're more than welcome to click on over to my Etsy spiritual shop. All that information will be listed in the description box below. Um, if you are wanting to purchase any of the 1111 candles, I would definitely advise you go ahead and get that because I am discontinuing them. Um... So, what's what's left in inventory is all that will be made for inventory purposes. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and jump into y'all's message. Gemini, I think it is so funny, okay? Um, so, I pulled just to see where y'all's energy was, and I got Ascended Masters. Um, I heard top of the food chain again, but powerful, loving, and wise spiritual teachers are watching over and guiding you. Um, I'm getting the energy of somebody who's definitely, um, like, I feel like something about, I keep hearing your higher ups, your higher ups, your higher ups. You're being ushered into a time where I feel like there is, ex I feel like you're being helped externally. For some of you, it's definitely spiritually, but for some of you, um, I feel like there's like a mentor or some kind of guidance that is being given to you in this time, like higher ups. I feel like you are definitely being watched. For those of you who are in your place of career, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling like there's somebody that you're not even aware of, like that's at the top of the game that is watching you, okay? Um, that's in the top of your place of employment that's definitely been keeping an eye on you um, and watching your growth. And I feel like they're wanting to help you get to another level okay um i am i heard the last become first and the first become last oh okay so um for some of you you were trying to get to a certain i feel like i don't even really feel like you were trying to um get to look a supervisor some of y'all are becoming supervisors managers i don't even feel like you had put in for a certain position but i feel like it's being handed to you um i'm getting the sense of higher ups definitely paying attention to what it is that you're doing i'm seeing work ethic here um like i feel like you put in the time energy and effort and i feel like you're definitely being observed in this time um observation is what i'm getting so um for some of you who are not aware you are being observed in your place of employment um i, I really just don't feel like you you're not fully aware of the level of observation that you're under in this time okay you're you may think that you're being looked at from um like the next level up but you're really be, being looked at from the top of the food chain, okay? There's something about um, the person who is over an entire company that is has been watching you or is watching you in this time and wanting you to excel. I'm definitely seeing you getting uh, a position over someone who... I feel like this person, you're getting a position over a person who is actually putting in for something, but they're not getting the position. It's, there's something in regards to a position someone else was actually trying to get that you weren't even trying to get, but you end up in this position over a certain individual. So for some of you, that's going to definitely be resonating in the next few days. Um, I'm definitely feeling that... <laughs> somebody's so upset about it somebody's so angry but it's like you're unfazed you're unbothered it's like you're you're grateful and you're thankful for the opportunity that's being given to you in this time but i don't feel like it's a make like it's not going to make or break you you are in the um you're in the energy of trying to figure out whether you're wanting to take the position or not and somebody's like so heated Somebody's so heated in the corner. Like, they just literally got overlooked, passed over for a position that you weren't even trying to get, okay? But it was given to you, or it's being offered to you in this time, okay? I had got, look, shield yourself. Shield yourself from that that energy. Somebody's really big mad. I think that's funny that that came up. I didn't even know that was there. We've got fairies, though. You have a strong bond with the fairies, and your life purpose involves helping mother nature and i got drawn to her sitting here let's see where my wand at 
homegirl's over here clutching her pearls, okay? I say clutching her pearls. That's when I saw the pearls. She's holding the pearls like, come get it if you want to, bitch. Like, she, like she's unbothered, unfazed. Um, but I did hear clutch your pearls. So, and shield yourself from being under it. Somebody is um, definitely wanting something that you have in this time. I am getting the sense of some of you are going to be acquiring some kind of gift in this time. So, like, I'm getting gifts. And achievements are coming in for the Gemini. And I'm feeling like it's stuff that you haven't, like it's, you didn't even ask for this is what I'm getting. I didn't ask for this, but you got it. And you're thankful that you have it. But I feel like you are also um, holding the energy of, you can try to take it if you want it, but I, like she's too relaxed. She's very relaxed in what, she, like you're just in a very relaxed position to be given. You are accepting things in this time. Like I feel like you're coming into an energy where you're realizing that you don't have to work um, very hard for a lot of things. They're just given to you. I'm, I am getting a sense of that and I feel like you do need to protect yourself. Um, because there is someone who is wanting what it is that you have. I don't feel like you're really tempting them, but you're like, bitch, if you want it, you can get it. But I, I just feel like you are definitely being observed in this time. And I feel like you're in a relax, very relaxed state. And you, you think that it's like this one person above you that has been watching... Like I heard the collective, watching the collective, watching the group of individuals that you work with. But it's actually someone over the person that you're working with is what I'm getting. Um, yeah, that's just really what I'm getting. I don't know why I'm seeing fast cash over here. For some of you, you're getting offered a new opportunity um, in your place of work, your career, your finances. Something new is coming in, but I feel like it's just a bit like a gift being given to you. But I'm also getting that it's something that you definitely deserve. It's not like you don't deserve what's being given to you. I feel like there is an individual who feels this way about what you're being given because they have been working so hard. They haven't seen the um, level of work that you put in. But you're very deserving of what you're being given, but I don't feel like you are really shooting for it, Okay. Okay, yeah, I'm telling came out. So be aware that this person who is trying to get the position that you're being offered or whatever it is that you're being offered in this time, they're going to be coming with any and all kinds of information that they can, that they can get on you in this time in order to try to, I heard, sway the public. For some of you, this is very public. This is like they're trying to get someone to see you in a different light secrets so i'm definitely see look i'm telling in secrets there are definitely going to be some secrets that are being outed this week in in this area okay for some of you it's i feel like it's financial i feel like there's some secrets there's some secrets going on with some people that you have some kind of financial tie to okay like pe people in your place of employment whoever this is that has been hating on you and who has watched you rise and just get things given to you this person is um look we got emotionally void but this person is really hoping i feel like they have been behind like they they knew that you were going to be offered something they didn't know to the extent of what you were being offered and the fact that you are um, getting put in a place of position over them they're pissed off about it okay so they're going out of their way to try to find any and every little little thing that they can get and take to the supervisor or take to management about you to get you in trouble be be mindful like as far as shield yourself if there isn't something that you're wanting to be known in this time be careful who you're telling because i feel like i am getting running mouth ghost rider it's somebody that you confide in um in the place of employment or you know if there's somebody that you're confiding in that you, you shouldn't really be telling all your information to because, you know, I feel like this individual may tell you certain things to get you to tell them more, okay? So they can run, I heard run and tell that homeboy. So I feel like some of you have been baiting a certain individual 
um, being really strategic with what you're telling this individual because you're wanting to see if they're going to run and tell. And they are. Okay, I feel like this person is definitely going to run and tell whatever information that you were trying to relay to an, a, another person, an outside individual. Okay, and I feel like it's actually whatever it is that you told this person is actually putting them in a panic. Third party situations, once again, and look, Hex came out. Third party and pity party. So, <laughs> this, this is like telling a story for real though. Oh my gosh, I'm telling. This person thought that they were going to be able to expose you. This person thought that they had some information that was going to expose you. But I'm seeing this individual actually being the one who is exposed. Okay, and they're like, whatever they thought that they were telling on you about is getting outed about them. And I really feel like it's, it's, it's something that they were trying to hide. There's something that this person was trying to hide, but it's like they had so much negative energy looming and so much hate. Like, I feel like karma is being restored in a certain situation. And instead of you getting outed for, you know, whatever they were trying to have come out about you, they're getting outed. And it's putting them in a state of panic. I'm getting pity party, though. Um, so they're really, I feel like they're actually regretting what they've done with Hex here. Like I'm seeing the card that I'm seeing like flash before my eyes that I don't have out is like eight of swords, um, mental conflict. Like, I feel like this person had hoped to put you in some sort of mental conflict and get you to expose like certain situations about yourself like addicted they were addicted to seeing you fall but they didn't so this is where they're at now they're like literally living in a pity party because of whatever they had tried to stir up um, i'm feeling the energy of something coming back on an individual who was trying to make some bullshit happen in your life okay like it's like they were addicted to seeing you fall and instead of seeing you fall they're seeing you rise. I feel like this is somebody that you worked with on some level. They're seeing you rise. And look, when I'm saying work with on some level, I got a random voice in my head that said co-parent. So this, this could be a co-parenting situation as well as, you know, what I'm talking about as far as your place of employment because this is a collective message or, or a general read for a lot of different individuals. Like... I feel like you have been detoxing yourself of individuals is what I'm getting. You've been detoxing yourself. There's like been a detoxification process going on for you where you have been purging negativity, purging negative energy, purging negative people out of your environment to where you can see clearly who is who in all relationships all aspects okay that's why I feel like I am getting this kind of like tempting energy here like I feel like you are you're no longer hiding what it is that you have or what you've been given okay you're not necessarily flexing and putting it in anybody's face but I feel like you are in this energy of yeah I got it okay like you're not making it like it's a huge deal but it's like you're not hiding it from the world anymore. You're not hiding your accomplishments, your achievements anymore. It's like, yes, they're here. Here it is, you know. Um, if somebody asks you about it, you won't just sit there and try to lower your... Make, make your achievements sound like they're less than... Like the, I feel like there's something about when people would compliment you or, you know, bring something up, you would somehow make it seem smaller than it really is no you're like yes this is you know i've done this this is what it is you know and you're accepting compliments you're accepting um you're you're, you're just ex you're in a more accepting energy period like you're accepting gifts you're accepting compliments you are no longer trying to um, make people feel better about their situation it's like you know you're you're in the energy of you can do it too it like you can do it too i feel like you are 
definitely the type of individual who wants to bring people with you, but you're no longer putting yourself, um, putting yourself out or making yourself cower or look smaller than you truly are. You're accepting your place in the world, okay? You're accepting your place in the company. And you are, you know, being an insp like I feel like you're inspiring in this time as well. You are an inspiration. And I feel like people are really starting to see that. And I feel like people really look up to you. And you're going to start actually seeing that within the next little while, okay? Um, but just know there is somebody who is throwing a pity party. They have either attempted to put a hex on you or send negative energy your way, but I feel like it failed or it will fail, okay? But this person is being outed. They had hoped that you would be the one to get exposed and lose your job or lose your place in the company or they were wanting to get your spot. But instead of this happening, you are rising, <laughs> rising to the occasion and showing off, you know, not necessarily showing off, but you're not hiding what it is that you're being given in this time. Okay. Oh my God. I just, <laughs> so I just started. I can't, I don't think I can even say it on, on, on YouTube. It's like, don't hide that, divide that. Oh my goodness. That was okay. Anyways, don't hide it. You're not hiding it anymore. Okay. You are not hiding. Anyways, that's y'all's message. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.